So this section is going to cover the soil sampling procedure. Uh, for soil sampling, you're going to need uh, a sample profile for each tree that you sampled uh, a twig from. Your location of your soil profile needs to be 2 dBH from that sample tree. What we're looking for is samples that start at uh, the surface, 0 centimeters, and then a sample for every 20 centimeter uh, increment or interval down to uh, essentially the bottom of your soil profile or at least down to one meter. If you have deeper soils, uh, you can go deeper. If you have shallower soils, that's just fine. What we're trying to do here is identify the uh, soil layer from which the tree is sourcing its water from. So the more of the profile that you can sample, the better chance that we're able to find that profile. So uh, we don't have the ability to dig a pit outside right now because it's negative 30. So we're in here at the whiteboard trying to sort of do this with a diagram. You have your tree. This uh, green is a sort of leafy litter layer that would probably be laying on, on the uh, forest floor. The first sample needs to come from below the leaf litter, so you can just uh, scrape away the leaf litter, get rid of it, and then take your first sample from the soil directly below that. To get below that, we use a soil core, something similar to this, and we just hand auger this down into the soil. And uh, it's very helpful to label 20 centimeters along the edge of this with tape or whatever works, marker, uh, to know how to know when 20 centimeters is. Uh, once you've dug down 20 centimeters, remove the soil core, take the soil, and uh, we find it easiest to dump the soil into some sort of bin uh, or uh, container which you can then mix it in. So take your hands, mix it up, get it good and mixed. What we're trying to do here is to be able to take a soil sample that represents that entire 20 centimeter uh, interval. So with the soil well mixed, grab your vial and uh, scoop up, fill up your vial with the necessary amount of soil so that there's no headspace. It's completely full. Get the cap on there and then uh, if conditions are good in the field, you can also do your parafilm there. And this process gets repeated through the entire soil profile. You can just dump out the soil in your container, reuse that same container, and do this for each 20 centimeter, 20 centimeter intervals all the way to the bottom of your soil profile. Uh, the main thing to keep in mind here is that you're trying to work quickly. Uh, once again, trying to just reduce the amount of evaporation that's occurring during the sampling procedure.